People living in one quiet Durham neighborhood are disturbed to learn a man's been killed in a weekend shooting there. This is an update to a story we first reported as breaking news last night at 11. CBS 17's Amalia Roy is live tonight and Amalia's shootings, police lights and crime tape are not something these neighbors are used to. No, it's not. People I've spoken to here are actually very shaken. Neighbors tell me this is a quiet street. Mostly people keep to themselves. There are some families who've lived here for around 20 years that tell me nothing like this has happened in the community before. When you see it, it's, it, it just makes it more real, even though I don't know who the gentleman was. It's just the fact that it was somebody. This neighbor says he was at home talking to his friend on the phone Friday night when he heard two gunshots outside. In the heavy rain, he couldn't see anything through his window, so he peeked his head out the door. Directly in front of my doorway, about 20 feet away in the road, was a person laying there. He says police were on scene before he could even finish giving dispatches information. The wounded man later died at the hospital. Meanwhile, while the neighborhood is stunned that something like this would happen. It just kind of made me start contemplating like, how am I gonna take care of myself as an individual in my neighborhood? How am I gonna take care of myself, my home? One woman who gave her security footage to investigators says she saw the gunman run towards the end of the street, which is a dead end. Durham PD says they don't yet have a suspect, but they do believe that it is an isolated incident. Reporting live in Durham, Amalia Roy, CBS 17 News.